Let's say you want to expand three brackets. So I want to expand out a triple bracket problem like this. Now, the easiest way to do this is to, first of all, expand two of the brackets and then expand the two brackets that you're left with. So, first of all, I'm going to choose, quite arbitrarily, two brackets to expand. So I'm going to expand those two. So I'm going to leave this one alone. And then I'm going to have 2x times minus 3x, so minus 6x squared. I've got 2x times 4, that's 8x, and 1 times minus 3x, so that's minus 3x. 8 and minus 3, so 5x. And then I've got 1 times 4 left over. Okay. If you want to take a little bit more time in expanding that, those two brackets, then please do so. What I really want to get down to is now expanding these two brackets here. Now, in the previous video, we used a table in order to do this. I might as well do the same thing. So we've got 3x and minus 1. And we have uh, minus 6x squared. We've got 5x. And then we've got 4. OK, so let me get uh, another colour. So we have 3x times minus 6x squared. So that's minus 18x cubed. 3x times 5x, so 15x squared. We've got 3x times 4, so 12x. Minus 1 times minus 6x squared, so 6x squared. Minus 1 times 5x. And then minus 1 times 4. OK, so from there, we can see that we've got minus 18x cubed. We've got 6x squared and 15x squared, so 21x squared. We've got minus 5x and 12x, so that makes 7x. And then finally, we've got the minus 4. OK? So that's how you can expand out triple brackets. Start by choosing two of the brackets to multiply out. Expand those, and then multiply out the two brackets that you have left.